If you live in or want to live in Northeast Los Angeles, you are going to want to hear this. I am Wendy Colton from Think Real Estate here in Highland Park. I'm going to look at the housing numbers for the first quarter of 2024 against the first quarter of 2023. Starting with the greater Northeast Los Angeles area, NELA, which for me is Highland Park, Eagle Rock, Glass Isle Park, Mount Washington, and then Silver Lake and Echo Park combined. And then I'll get into each of those neighborhoods. All right, Northeast Los Angeles, first quarter of 2024. Number of homes sold was down 6% to 158. Average days on market was actually 6% faster at 30 days. The average price pretty much stayed the same at 1.38 million. And the size of the home was down 5% to 1,538 square feet. The average price per square foot was up 3% to $935 a square foot. And the number of new listings is down 3% from 262 last year to 253 houses this year. So the low inventory situation in the greater Northeast Los Angeles area um, still looks to be holding. Now we're going to look at Highland Park for the first quarter. Number of homes sold basically stayed the same at 34 this year versus 36 last year. Days on market were down 56% which means that it was faster so it's just 19 days on market 56% faster. The average price was up 13% to 1.26 million. That's a big number. And the size of the home was down 7% to 1,395 square feet. The price per square foot was up 13% to $935 a square foot. So I'm gonna say that the 13% uh, increase in the average price uh, was pretty much real. The number of new listings in Highland Park was up 6% to 68. So inventory is up slightly in Highland Park for the first quarter of the year, which is nice to see. Looking at Eagle Rock, number of homes sold up 17% to 28 homes. Days on market, 33% faster to just 14 days on the market. That's crazy. The average price in Eagle Rock pretty much stayed the same at 1.46 million. The size of the home was down slightly 4% to 1,652 square feet versus 1,713 last year. Price per square foot was up 6% to $929 a square foot. So the average price is about the same and the size was down about 4% and the price per square foot was up 6%. So I'm going to say the price has ticked up slightly in Eagle Rock for the first quarter of 2024. Number of new listings was up 21% to 40. So it's nice to see a bump in inventory in Eagle Rock in the first quarter. All right, now looking at Glassall Park for the first quarter of 2024 versus last year. Number of homes sold down 36% to just 14 homes sold. The days on the market went up to 47 days, so homes are selling slower, about 47% slower. The average price down 10% to 1.08 million. The size was down 3% to 1495 square feet, and the price per square foot was also down 8% to 767 a square foot. So all those numbers are down, so I think there was a, a bit of a drop in prices in Glassell Park for the first quarter. Uh, number of new listings down 22% to just 21 new listings in the first quarter of 2024. Now let's look at Mount Washington for the first quarter. Number of homes sold was up 87% to 28 homes sold. The days on the market were down to 28, so homes were selling 15% faster than the first quarter of last year. The size of the home down 24% to 1272 a square feet, so that has actually has a big impact on the average price dropping. The price per square foot was up 21% to $963 a square foot. So take that drop of 11% in the average price with a grain of salt. It's just that smaller homes were selling and that means that the price per square foot always goes up. And the number of new listings, 6% fewer new listings from 33 to 31 in Mount Washington. All right, now we're looking at the large area of Silver Lake and Echo Park combined for the first qu quarter of 2024 to 2023. The number of days on market went up 42 days, so homes are sitting a little bit longer. The average price went up 3% to 1.62 million. Uh, the size of the homes basically stayed the same at 1739 versus 1724 last year. The price per square foot was down 4% to $940 a square foot. So I'm going to say the prices in Silver Lake and uh, Echo Park were flat year on year since the price per square foot was down 4% while the average prices were up 3%. So they kind of cancel each other out. Uh, number of new listings was down 10% from 105 to 93 in 2024. 
All right, that is my Q1 market update for all of Northeast Los Angeles. If you have any questions about any of these numbers or you're interested in maybe in your home value, please DM me. I'd love to talk to you. Bye,